On average, every day, 15 people in the U.S. are diagnosed with ALS. It is a diagnosis that brings with it a promise of loss. A disease that affects the nerves and muscles. Loss of strength is often followed by paralysis and the inability to speak. Tonight, only on News 3, Dave Delosier has the story of a program saving the words that matter the most. Oh, that's a cute picture. Through all of the memories, Nine years of memories for Dennis and Linny. Look at. There were memories too of spoken words. Dennis, it seemed, always knew the right words to say. He just talked about everything. Those words and photographs tell their story until a day two years ago. That's the person you love, and you you don't want to change anything. But most everything did change when Dennis was diagnosed with ALS. In the terrible time. The walk, the look your doctor in the eye and have him tell you you're dying. The reality of ALS is that it takes and it takes. First, Dennis's strength, then the ability to walk. Now, his ability to speak. Which is why on this day, Dennis is going to the bank. I always tell people that don't ever think that there's not going to be a way to communicate. We got a little bit programmed. At this bank, what's deposited are voices. Okay. A year ago, while his voice was still strong, Dennis recorded 1,600 phrases and deposited them in the voice bank. You've done some programming already. A little bit. Okay. Today, he's making a withdrawal, putting his voice onto an iPad, using a program called Model Talker Everyday Life. Let's stop and eat that screen. Oh. can be ever so easy again. It has your personality in your voice, so I think that's pretty awesome. And in his voice, you hear the things that make Dennis, Dennis. Go Badgers. Does that sound like your voice? <laughs> and even though ALS will continue to take and take. This is my wife, Lenny. The voice bank will prevent ALS from taking what matters most. If I want to tell her I love her, I can tell her. And it will be me now hearing that. That's Pa, that's Dennis, <laughs> that's, you know, my husband. I love you, Lenny. That's Dennis. And when you hear it, it's like the disease is not even there. And that look, that one, tells you what this means to Dennis. Yeah, it's pretty phenomenal. At the voice bank. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> this is Dave Delosier, WISC News 3. All right, you guys take care. Have a safe trip back. Dennis is very grateful that he recorded his voice saying those 1,600 phrases a year ago. Experts say doing so early is important for anyone diagnosed with ALS. Well, a beautiful story, and the smile on his face says it all. For more information on voice banking, you can visit modeltalker.org or contact your health care provider.